Candace from Performance Team. And today, this video is for all you landlords out there. So right now, we have a huge need for people who are looking for short-term rentals. And I know a lot of landlords are like, I really don't want to rent it out short term because they probably won't take care of the property. It'll cost me a lot of money to get it renovated and ready for the next tenant. But let me tell you why you should definitely rethink that and change your mindset. So here's what I know. I have clients coming from all over. I'm talking, they are coming in drones and they have no place to go when they get here. They've already sold their property somewhere else, wherever they came from, California, New York, just to name a few. Um, and they have nowhere to go when they get here because like everybody else, they've been submitting multiple offers on homes and they're not getting them accepted and they have to have a place to live. But some of these people have children or some of these people you know, have a place that they need to work from home remotely. So an apartment's not something that's gonna be a good option for them. So this is why you should consider turning your rental into a short-term rental. So we got a client who moved here from Indiana. They didn't have a home to move into. Again, they had submitted multiple applications or, or offers on homes. They didn't get them accepted. And they said, listen, we have to be here March 1st. We have nowhere to go. Can you please help us? And I said, absolutely. I got on the phone. I started calling every for rent by owner that I could find in the area. And I found them a couple. And one of them was being rented or advertised for rent for $1,800 a month. We got them $2,400 a month for six months for them to rent this short term. And they don't have to worry about the tenant. Why? Because these are highly qualified people moving into these homes. They're qualified to purchase a home for a lot more than the house that they're renting. If you were to sell them your home that you rent to them, they could afford it twice over. So you're getting a highly qualified tenant in there. They're gonna take good care of it. They have excellent credit and references. They have money in the bank because guess what? They just sold their house. So they have the funds to pay more for your home. And guess what? It's not gonna take you a lot of time and money to get that house turned. And why I'm on the topic, you should consider not doing a 12 month lease, but just keeping it as a short term rental. And tip for you, if you're able to furnish it, you can even get more for your short-term rental. Just maybe some furniture here and there off Facebook Marketplace, Nebraska Furniture Mart when it goes on sale. Um, a couch, a bed would go a long ways because people don't wanna move their stuff twice. They'd rather just put it in storage and then have it put in their new house when they close on it. Um, and that gives our clients time to be able to look for a house. But more importantly, it's about getting you more money for your house, solving an absolute huge problem we have here. And it's a win-win. So if you are a landlord in the Dallas-Fort Worth area and you are thinking about renting it out for 12 months, give me a call. I guarantee you I can find somebody who will pay 25, 30% more in rent just to be able to rent it for six months versus 12 months.